Hello all of you. So here is a quick guide to SP5. SP5 has 25 chapters and these are divided into six parts. The first part covers the first six chapters. These are basic building blocks where you will be learning different specialist asset classes, uh, different derivatives like options, futures. These are very important and building blocks for your uh, SP5 journey ahead. Then we have the next section which come, has four uh, chapters. These four chapters are again theory chapters but very interesting. It covers behavioral finance and different regulatory frameworks. The third part which is very important, it also covers the different proofs and valuation of different kind of investments like swap valuations, NFRA and a lot of different stuffs. And it's very very important that you study these chapters very nicely because they are very tricky and very difficult at the same time. The fourth part is very interesting. It has different ways of performance measurement, uh, portfolio attribution and different calculations. Very interesting and you can build models on this and keep it handy with yourselves and also investment indices which is again very interesting. The fifth part has another four chapters. These are different actuarial techniques, different financial risks, how to mitigate these risks and the last part is again portfolio management wherein you will be learning about how you can, you can use uh, different derivatives and whatever you have studied so far in order to manage your portfolio. So it's very interesting and happy learning.